It's kind of dark, another misty dusk. And it came from a tangle down below. And I tried to remember everything you taught me so well. I had to decide which way to go. Was I alone or in a hunter's dream? Cause the moment of truth was here and now. I felt his touch, I felt his guiding hand. The buck was mine forevermore. Because of Fred Bear, I'll walk down these trails again. Alright folks, welcome back to another edition of Let's Play the Hunter with Cal Hunter. Um, today I want to do some fox hunting, I think, and um, let's go ahead and look in the inventory here and see what I got. Alright, I think I want to use the 223 today, so I'm going to replace this guy. There we go. Get some rounds. We'll start out with the uh, illuminated scope, but I, I also got the 12 by 50 here for the longer range. Um, let's get a few more, a few more ammo here. Where are these guys at? Drag those guys in. Let's take some of these just in case I want to use the bow here. Um, ninety-three. Let's go up here. There. We'll take a pack of those just for our uh, 8x57 there. And we don't need the pig collar or the squealer. We got our fox call. And I could probably bring a roe deer and Let's see here. So we have a collar. And we should have a there's that and let's throw in throw in some smoke too. That one we can get rid of. That one we can get rid of. Okay, so that's kind of what it looks like. Uh we're gonna use the two two three here and uh I'm gonna go get us some fox. So let's go ahead and uh, get out of this. And what do we got? What are we wearing today here? All right, we're gonna switch over to our white white camo, I think. So let's get back in here. And that should do it for now. So, I'll go ahead and get started here, and then uh, we'll bring you all back when uh, we, we get a call. Bye for now. All right, folks, I uh, got a call here. Just called. You can see on the 180s right out in front of me. 
let's make it to the top of this ridge here and we'll uh, see if we can get them over here. We're in here. It's hard to pick them up quick. Let's get ready here. This is a better area. is below us. Oh, he's looking right at us. He's a quick one. Wait, I don't think I hit him. Let's take a look. Just a running. I know I didn't hit him with that second one, third one probably either. First one I thought I, I hit him with, but the game is telling me otherwise. See any movement out there? All right. What I'm going to do is stay on this track, and we'll see if we can uh, track him back down here and maybe hit him this time. Okay, um, I'll send you away for a bit and bring you back once I track this guy down. Bye for now. Okay, folks, I'm back. Um, still tracking this fox. You can see on the 108 there, I still following him. Looks like he's heading towards the out of bounds area there. They took a quick peek around here. I'm, I'm not seeing him, so I'm going to move forward. Um, take a look at the map. I'll show you kind of where I'm heading. Oh, there's a call right there, so uh, let's give him a call back. We'll get back to the map there. So that's our guy right down there. Let's see if we can call him in right on this hill here. We'll sit here. Where 
where he's going to come from here. Let's move over just a smidge. See how this works. That time we got him. It's funny, every time I go to shoot, he ducks under the grass. Alright, he ran, but he didn't get away. Let's see what we got here. Alright. Eh, kind of small, but nice little fox. Alright. Got an unlock, that's alright, too. Get a picture. Alright. Um, let's go back to the map for a second here. So I started out at the cabin, and um, originally I think I tried to shoot this guy up in here either up in here or here, I can't remember which one it was. Um, of course, I miss, everyone saw that, that was nice. And then we moved up and uh, spotted them here, so all that worked out pretty good. Now basically I'm gonna probably head, probably back up through here, and um, I may cut back just a little bit here and then and kind of through here so we'll we'll give that a shot okay I'll be on my way and then uh, I'll bring you all back when uh, I get another call bye for now okay folks uh, I ran into a road here here pretty close and I think I'm just gonna take this Deer been all over the place. Every time I'm walking, they're running. I think you're scaring the fox off. Long heart shot, which should be fine. That must have been the second shot there in the in the back end there. Okay. I'll keep pushing forward and if I could clear these road deer out, I think I'd do a little better on the fox because I think they just, when they're running, they're just scaring them off. But uh, I'll keep pushing forward and bring you back when something else comes up. Bye for now. Okay, folks, I hear something real close. I think it's right up above the hill here. Let's see if we can uh, edge up. 
Don't scare it. Boy, I can't believe that thing's running. Hit that bugger right in a sweet spot. Listen to those buggers yell. All right, well, he didn't go too far. But, long heart shot. Let's see what we got here. Right lung. Okay, yeah, we were, uh, let me see if I can find this uh, fox track again, because I was on a on a track when I came started coming up the hill and uh, heard this roe deer here. Let's see what we got here. Here we go. So this is the track I was on. We're going to continue on this guy here. Stand up for now. Yeah, it's been pretty slow, this hunt. You can kind of see I've been through here and I, I got that one fox is all. This is the first track I've seen since I got that first one. So. It's been pretty slow around here for for the fox. Getting a lot of roe deer, a lot of roe deer action going on, but uh, not really chasing them down too much. I just I'll shoot them if they get in my way, and but I really want to get the fox. Now we need to find the next track, and for some reason, I'm not seeing it, and I should have seen it already. So, what we're looking for is a full globe, not not these half globes. When they're half globes, that means they're a different track than you're you're tracking at the time. So this full globe is basically what we're looking for. And um, let's see where he goes here. Oh wow, he changed direction on me. That's why. So let's try this way. There we go. You can still see it's dotted line all the way around, so it's I'm not too close to it yet. So that's kind of why I'm walking. I'll start crouching when I get a get a solid line. You can see these roe deer are just all over here today. It's 
like it's starting to open up a little bit down there. That could be good. Those foxes went quite a ways. Let's just take a peek around here. Sometimes you can spot them when it gets this wide open. There's a road up there. There's another road here. Okay, I'm not seeing anything. Let's keep pushing forward. Of course, he's going to track back into where we already went through. This is kind of how it's been my whole trip here, is just kind of walking through the woods. Usually I get a few more calls than that than I've gotten today, so... I guess that's why they call it hunting. You never know what you're going to end up with. Now I'm lost the track again here, it looks like. Because I should have seen one by now. This guy is tricky. Alright, what I'm going to do is uh, I'll keep tracking this and I'll bring you all back when I get close. Bye for now. Alright folks, welcome back. Uh, just got a call. And um, let's see if we can get him to come in here. It's about straight out in front of me here. see what we got here. Let's try the big scope once, see what we look like. Alright, we'll 
I'm going to try this. It's probably a little too close, but if I can pick them up on the ridge, then I'll be all right. If not, we'll change it out. Most likely it'll be like usual. And it'll come from somewhere I'm not looking. I better change it up. Maybe could have been just out of range. Let's move up a bit. up to the ridge. Try it again. up here. Well, 
that's even a different one than I had before, but we'll uh, chase it down here. Nice big rock here. Should have enough time to get up on here. This will work out nicely. That has to get us something. There he is. I caught a glimpse of him up front here, just below that hill. Well, uh, looks like another orange box. We didn't get any of the darker ones, but uh, it's okay to you. Walk on over and see what we got. Change my globe colors. Green was all right, but it was getting some situations. It was kind of hard to see. Twenty-four, not bad, not bad at all. Alright folks, I think that's going to do it for uh, today's episode. I uh, hope you all enjoyed it. And um, until next time, happy hunting.